This is my public apology for flirting too much. Hi, I'm Stephanie and I'm here to play Suck It Up. It's like never have I ever, but for everything I have done, I have to eat one of these sour candies. And as the questions get harder, never have I ever gotten sick of my own sour. <laughs> you got me there. <laughs> the candies get more sour. <laughs> oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Let's get it. Never have I ever thought Indonesian fast food was better than American fast food. I have not. <laughs> because your girl loves bread. <laughs> Asia and Indonesia, like, we love our rice. But I love my bread. <laughs> so, I have not. Never have I ever played Minecraft for more than six hours in a row. <laughs> I played it for 12 hours in a row at one point. I was really bored and my survival world was thriving. So, I have. Sad to say, because now I have to eat that. Which color should I use? I guess like an orange. It matches my suit. <laughs> okay, okay now. Okay, now it's sweet. I like that. I mean, I don't like that, but I like that it's sweet now. Lit, okay. Oh, you can chew it. Never have I ever planned out my future wedding. I have not. I want you to be my husband. Because I actually never thought I'd get married. Still probably don't. Best friends for life, man. You know, let's just be like good buddies that love each other. <laughs> never have I ever wanted to curse in a song. I have never because I am a family friendly queen. <laughs> I don't usually swear anyways, so I don't usually swear in a song. Never have I ever had a terrible first date. Baby, take my hand. I want you to be my best friend. I have not because I've never been on a first date. All the people that I've been close with have been like good friends. And so we just kind of never did that first date thing. We just always end up kind of being like, yo, I like you as a friend, but like also more. And then I'm like, okay, cool. Never have I ever been mistaken for another celebrity. I have not, which I don't know if it's, it's a good thing or a bad thing, but I guess it's the nose. People are always like, you know it's you for the nose. But they said if I didn't have my nose, they'd probably think I was my mom because apparently I look like her. So, okay. Never have I ever actually watched Iron Man. I have, of course. I would be like lying if I said I did not. Funny thing, my dad is a huge Marvel fan. So he took me to most of the Marvel movies when they came out. And we watched Iron Man and even Endgame together, so. Yeah, shout out dad. Love you. You also are causing my pain right now. So thank you. I'm gonna try to like high fashion it, okay? <laughs> oh my god, oh my god. Oh my god, oh my god. Ew. It tastes like <laughs> It tastes like I'm eating like lemon dish soap. Not that I have. Woo. Now it's sweet. You know, life is like that, guys. You know, it always starts off sour, but the sweet end will come. <laughs> Never have I ever been in love. Girl, I fall in love way too easily, so I have. I always tell my parents, like, parents, like, you don't have to worry about me with like anything. Like, you know, I will always try my best in school. I will never lie to you. I won't you know, drink or do anything. But I do have an issue with love because I fall in love way too easily. So I'm like, you better take care of me when I cry because apparently a guy doesn't love me back. So I will have to eat this. I guess that's what I get for being in love too often. I need to also feel the pain of a thousand heartbreaks. I won't go for the green one because I feel like green is like lime. So I'm gonna go for, not yellow because it's lemon. I don't like blueberries, so maybe this is either cherry or strawberry, or there might not even be a flavor because it's just sour. I guess I'll have to be I got over it. TikTok dances are saving my life. Maybe I should just keep doing that. This one is more sour. But I think also because this one, I focused on it. 
Whereas this one, I was thinking of um, my future as a TikTok star. So that's good. I like it. Never have I ever stolen something. You like stolen your heart. No. Aww. I don't think I ever have because genuinely, I always thought like, I just don't want to go to hell um, or go to jail. Never have I ever gotten sick of my own song. <laughs> You got me there. <laughs> well, the thing is, when I did um, I Love You 2000, I had to, you know, kind of produce it myself and do everything. So I already got sick of it even before it came out. Because you kind of have to just keep going on and on to listen to it and see whether it's like up to par, up to your standards. Now I want you to be my husband. So I have, and I bet a lot of people have too. So that's why I'm kind of like releasing new music. So, so I think this is grape. I love the grape flavor if it's not grape and it's actually like toxic waste then oops that's what the candy's called toxic waste <laughs> my mind whoa <laughs> okay it has no smell which makes me really scared okay i'm sorry <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I have never salivated that much in my life. It hurts. <laughs> never have I ever feuded with a label mate. I have not because everyone on my label is really nice. Shout out. I love them very much. Never have I ever had a crush on someone I collabed with. I want this to be something. As much as I love Jackson, it's not a crush because it's more like a huge fan moment for me. Because basically, I had his albums, I had his photo cards, had, had like all the GOT7 posters. It wasn't really a crush, it was more like a very strong admiration. And so when I met him, it was kind of like me meeting Beyonce. So, never have I ever flirted with a fan on Twitter. <coughs> what is your definition of flirt though? Probably have. Like I said, I flirt too much, I fall in love too much, so I wouldn't remember, but I'm pretty sure I have. Which means <laughs> I have to go <laughs> eat that. Whichever fan I flirted with, you did this. <laughs> I'm kidding. This is my public apology for flirting too much. It literally looks like an egg yolk, like a cured egg yolk in salt except it's not salt, it's pain. The smiley face on top makes it worse because it gives you a false sense of comfort and happiness when in reality, it's the literal devil, probably. I don't know. It can't be too bad, right? <laughs> oh my god, 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 oh my god. Is that citric acid? Sugary. Uh, sugary citric acid. I'm a chef. Just kidding. I can't handle this one. Not bad. I mean, it was really bad, but my body's kind of feeling better now. This one is much worse. But yeah. I'm really bad at anything sour, so if I can do it, you can do it. Okie dokie, thanks Delish for having me. I have two new songs out called Do You Love Me In Touch. Uh, I love them very much and I would really appreciate it if you check them out. It's been Stephanie Poetry and I love you.